very very good morning very very good afternoon and uh, very very good evening students here i am pankaj pande from mincat pc and uh, ex bepro senior project engineer today in this video i am i am going to discuss about the type of computer memory in this video i am totally explain about the memory of computers how much memory how many type of memory is used by laptop is used by desktop etc so all of you looking here the computer memory is basically divided into two part first is called the internal memory and second is called the external memory this is internal memory and this is the external memory two type of memory is used my laptop my desktop either my mobile okay and uh, the internal memory what is internal memory a memory that is used inside our laptop inside our desktop either inside our mobile phone this type of memory is called the internal memory now external memory the memory which is externally used like as a pen drive like as a hard disk like as a ssd like as a cd dvd etc is called the external memory so the internal memory first of all i want to look about the internal memory the internal memory is basically divided into the two part first is called rom and second is called ram rom is read only memory and ram is random access memory okay rom is permanent memory and ram is temporary memory rom is used as a storage while ram is a speed provider this memory is provide the speed our speed of my laptop my desktop and my memory my mobile phone okay the rom rom is read only memory the read only memory is divided into three part first is prom programmable read only memory second is eprom eprom means erasable programmable read only memory and third is eeprom means electrical erasable programmable read only memory so the rom is divided into two part first is called programmable read only memory and the second is called the erasable programmable read only memory third is called the electrical erasable programmable read only memory okay this all is part of our rom okay now ram ram is i am already tell you ram is a read only memory random access memory the random access memory is divided into two part first is called sram and second is called the tram sram what is sram sram is a static random access memory and dram is a dynamic random access memory the sram means static random access memory what is this the static random access memory is faster than dynamic random access memory means the sram is faster than dram second the sram is used as a cache memory if you don't know about the cache memory then you should search the video on my youtube channel you will find the better about that then the dram dram is a divided in three part dynamic random access memory is divided into three part first is called the hd ram and second is called the rd ram and third is called the ddr hd ram means three part first is hd ram second is rd ram and third is ddr hd ram this all is part of the ram this all is part of the ram and it all is part of the internal memory so sd ram rd ram is a part of d ram and third ddr hd ram is also a part of d ram but ddr hd ram is divided into four part 
all of you can look here ddr hd ram is divided into three four part the first is called the ddr1 and second is called the ddr2 and third is called the ddr3 and fourth is called the ddr4 here this is all part of our internal memory and now we are going to look at the external what is external memory and the type of the external memory the definition of external memory is i am already explained starting of my video the part of external memory is hdd hard disk everybody know everybody listen about the hard disk a disk that is used in our laptop in our desktop is store our data is used to store our movies and any things is stored in our hard disk but in nowadays our laptop is removing the hard disk and accessing the sdd sdd is also a similar as a hard disk it is also use or manage the data it is also is used to reading or writing the ssd is costly more costly than the hard disk so ssd is basically used in modern laptops either that will dell either that laptop is any companies dell acer lenovo hp and all and third is uh, the part of external memory that is cd compact disk and fourth is usb is also part of external memory and pen drive our pen drive is also part of the external memory and uh, dvd everybody know about the dvd is also a disk type cassettes it also a storage device cd and dvd both are the storage device so hdd ssd cd dvd usb and our pen drive all is external memory and the left side this all is the external internal memory in internal memory rom and rom rom and ram and in external memory this all if you have any confusion in my video then you can comment your problem i will certainly reply to you so the students who is taking the admission in any computer courses adc dca any engineering fields bca bsc cs it btech mca this video is most important for the students who is try to achieve the knowledge in computer fields so my channel is basically for the computer knowledge my channel is basically for the placement in top multinational companies so if you want to placement then must you should subscribe my channel and like my video everybody have a nice day and have a nice night best of luck